Alright, here we go. Let's have some fun here. How's it going, everybody? It's your boy Sandy here. I'm a, at least a good couple days late talking about this, but let's just be honest here. Um, this is definitely something that I should probably talk about as quickly as possible. So you guys probably remember Playmate Tessie. I covered her a couple months ago. Um, she was one of those kinds of, you know, I guess you could call them IRL streamers on YouTube, where... All she would do is just, you know, film herself in front of her laptop's camera and then just act like a complete and total asshat to whoever the hell was within earshot. And on top of that, too, she ended up getting some sort of pseudo-infamy due to a clip of her kind of circulating around uh, the internet of her making fun of a literal leukemia patient. And, I mean... I wish I was making that up, but you can quite literally watch my previous two videos talking about it if you if you want to know all about it, because I do not feel like giving you a whole Cliff Notes, uh, you know, ex explanation of what has happened um, when I made those two videos. But ever since I made my last video talking about her, a lot of other stuff had started happening uh, regarding her. After she ended up getting kicked out of the house, she ended up just getting even worse somehow. On her Instagram, she started making videos talking about how people that are mentally handicapped should be thrown into chambers and gassed and how um she and i quote believes in racism <laughs> i would i wish i was making that up but i'm genuinely not like that th this is how stupid this bitch is and on top of that too she ended up getting her uh channel nuked off of the, off of youtube so her main channel no longer exists there's people saying that she has some like some sort of an alternate account or something like that i genuinely wouldn't be surprised although i guarantee you she probably doesn't even have enough iq points to actually figure out how to reopen that alternate account of her she probably due to the fact that her iq is basically below freezer temperature at this point it's just kind of like that there's no hope for her at this point so even if she did have an alternate account she probably doesn't have the brain capacity to try and remember how to get into it so you're probably wondering to yourself well why am i talking about her right now well it's because she ended up appearing on dr phil let's just get into it before i start rambling on too much i am famous for being beautiful gorgeous amazing and talented i already have to stop you right there jesus christ i almost forgot how insufferable her voice is Th this this bitch is so insufferable to listen to that i feel like i'm gonna have to take multiple breaks while i'm recording this entire video because jesus christ Christ, I hate it. But on top of that too, she decided to open up with, Oh, I'm famous for being gorgeous, amazing, and talented. First of all, you're not gorgeous. You quite literally look like the very definition of, like, the most plastic human being, like, on planet Earth right now. Amazing. No, you're not. Like, one thing that you're amazing at is being an insufferable asshole and being quite possibly one of the worst individuals to ever set foot online. And talented, the only talent that you have is being capable of driving me nuts just with your voice alone. I'm live 24-7. One night I fell asleep during my live stream. My dad decided that it would be a good idea to yell at my sister, completely stealing my spotlight. I love the fact that Playmate Tessie is actually so unbelievably dumb. So unfathomably stupid, so devoid of any actual physical brain inside of her skull, that even when she's on national f***ing television, she just cannot even seem to restrain that ego. She quite literally came out here and said, Are you stealing my spotlight? God, that's the closest I'll ever get to this brat's voice. God, I hate it. I literally woke up and people were just making fun of me and rightfully so you really deserve to be made fun of i have not contacted my dad whatsoever he's just a jealous hater <laughs> i can't even say with a straight face that you you can't make stuff like this up she l just is your uh. my biggest fear is that my dad's going to use this narrative to make me look like a liar. Oh, don't worry. He doesn't have to set up a narrative to make you look like a liar at all. You already do it yourself by constantly filming yourself lying through your teeth. I was doing my thing being famous and I decided to just troll. How pathetic can you be? You're fat, you're ugly, you look deformed. I was okay, if that is your definition of trolling, then like... Uh, <laughs> Are you getting your trolling lessons from the trolls? Like, what What kind of garbage is- That's not trolling! That's you being an ass! 
ass. And I was like, oh, you know, messed up hairline, wig, and oh, wig, cancer, you know? I just connected the dots. She wasn't actually wearing a wig. I thought everything I said was funny. I thought it was hilarious. Well, I mean, yeah, of course you would think that it was hilarious, but allow me to quickly find the grand total of other individuals that found it funny. All right, so I currently have someone looking around right now trying to see, you know, a, uh, a grand total of everyone in the multiverse um, that could possibly find this funny. Um, oh, hey. All right, the results just came in. And, oh. Looks like a grand total of zero found that funny. Despite what you jealous haters think, like, I have morals. I would never attack anybody who's like a minor, visibly disabled. But reposted people were saying things like, you're gonna find me, kill me. These cancer patients wanted an apology, so I gave them a f apology. Why, yes, you did give them an apology. An apology that you openly stated was going to be extremely half-hearted and that you didn't mean in the first place. I mean, hell, you quite literally named that stream I'm sorry and you misspelled it because of the fact that you have below freezer temperature IQ. I'm sorry, but like, honestly, you quite literally within that stream said that you weren't going to mean anything that you were going to say. So even your... So even you trying to claim that you apologized is completely thrown out of the water because of something that you yourself said! Jesus Christ! Can we, can we, can we replay that? Can we play that clip? Do we still have that clip of where she quite literally says at the beginning of that same exact stream that she wasn't going to mean the apology at all? Can we please play that real quick? Okay, thanks. I'm not gonna f***ing apologize. I'm not sorry for anything as if. I'm not f***ing sorry I didn't do anything. I literally didn't even f***ing do anything. And like, I feel like I gave an amazing apology. No, seriously, that whole Reddit situation. Do you guys really want me to apologize? Do you really want me to apologize? Because if you guys really want me to apologize, then I'll f***ing do it. But just know that it's going to be fake. I mean, hey, there it is. Straight from the horse's ass. I knew I was born famous. A superstar. <laughs> and if you... <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to end it right here because there is nothing that is going to top that. The fact that the audience themselves literally started fucking busting out laughing at that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, you can't make this up. You can't make this up. People like this are actually this stupid. I I'm done. I'm done. That's the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed, please consider leaving a like. You know, you get the point. All right, just... I don't know, man. Have a nice day. This has been Sanity. Ugh. Sort of, sort of say goodbye. See you again sometime. la da 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 この瞬間が宝物君たちと私いつまでも今日も生きてよかった